How's it going guys? My name is Ishan and in this video I'm going to be covering the full technical analysis and short term price target for both the GME and AMC stock in just 5 minutes. So let's get to it. Alright so jumping into the technicals on GME stock on this 1 month 30 minute chart we can see a few things right off the bat. Last video I told you guys how we were forming this falling wedge and that's a signal that there's potential for the stock to bounce back. Not only that but we got a MACD cross with a red MACD line cross above the green signal line so things were overall looking bullish. Today we ended up pushing up all the way to this $130 level which was the exact level I told you guys to watch for if the stock moved higher. It was my very first price target. Along with that as you can see we've been forming higher highs and higher lows and this is a super bullish pattern that signals that the stock has now changed direction. Along with that if you go to the six month daily chart we can see some few other bullish things. First of all again we got a MACD cross over here but it also looks like we're forming a bullish Harami candle. Essentially, this occurs after two days of prices dropping. This signals somewhat of buyer strength and buyers stepping up to try to push the stock up. And so it's a bullish reversal pattern. It doesn't always go according to plan, but lining it up with all the other indicators we just looked at, GME is looking somewhat bullish right now. And another thing I like to see that despite this drop, we still have quite a bit of volume. If you take a look at a lot of of other stocks that get pumped up and drop back down volume dies down fast but as for GME I guess just because it has a lot of hype we have a lot of volume as well and so it's good to see that there's still buyers and people entering the stock so now that you get a rough idea of how the technicals are looking let's talk about my quick short-term price target so I definitely believe the stock could still retest this 130 level which I talked about last video if it breaks above this $130 level this stock could retest about this 175 level where it had resistance over here and overall in this general area up over here. However, if the stock somehow changes direction, which is totally possible, it's totally possible, especially with how volatile GME stock is, then I could see the stock dropping down and retesting this about $85 level where it had support right over here. And if the stock does end up breaking this $85 level, then it could be heading a lot, lot lower. Before I jump into AMC's technicals, be sure to check out the Gen Z Trader Academy link down below where my goal is to help you learn technical analysis so that you become more profitable and make better entry and exit decisions. So be sure to check it out down below. All right, so jumping into the technicals for AMC stock now, we can see a few things right off the bat. Last video, I told you guys how we were forming the symmetrical triangle and overall, I thought the symmetrical triangle was gonna squeeze higher because we got an EMA cross, we had a MACD cross back over here and I told you guys that the stock would most likely push up to this about $9 level, which was the exact exact level the stock pushed up to today it actually pushed up a little higher which is honestly better now similar to GME I'm also liking how we're forming higher highs and higher lows now this again signals that the trend direction has changed and now buyers are consistently stepping up and raising their bids to keep the stock going in this uptrend and that is pretty bullish and another thing you can notice is now the stock is consistently holding the 9 EMA which is this blue line and the 21 EMA which is the purple line and and so that's again bullish. The EMA lines are like the holy grails of trend direction. If the stock is above it, it's bullish. If the stock is below it, that's bearish. So this is overall looking kind of bullish right now. And we can see the same thing on the six month chart. The stock pulled back right down to the nine EMA, which is the blue line. Boom, bounce, and now we're following through. That's what you always want to be waiting for and being patient. You always want to see the stock following through. And so I'm liking that trend. And overall, now that you get a rough understanding of AMC's technicals, let's talk about my price target. So I still think the stock could retest this $11 level if buyers step up. If we can get a definitive break above this $9 level, I could definitely see the stock retesting $11. However, if the stock breaks lower, then I could see the stock going back to $8 where it had support over here, support over here, and below $8 then the stock could be heading to seven where it had support back over here and resistance as well. So those are the key levels to watch guys. Make sure to like, subscribe and check out the Gen Z Trader Academy where my goal is to help you learn technical analysis and become more profitable and make better exit and entry points. So with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy, clocking out for now. Peace.